My grandfather started the business here in St. Louis in 1918. We have been ranked by Engineering News Record as the 55th largest contractor in the country. This used to be a metal fabrication plant. It was built in the 1950s, and now it houses our um, headquarters, our international headquarters. We reused as much of what we found here, but we paid special attention to the energy use, the recycling of the materials, the use of water, and other resources that are part of the building, and we tried to make it as friendly for the users as we could. Facilities such as this, there's an integrated approach. 20% of the year, here in the Midwest, we can run on natural ventilation, which means the window's open. We can turn off the HVAC system and run on free cooling mode. The thing that makes it high performance is that all of those subsystems are working together at peak efficiency in order for the building itself to be the most efficient it can. In this facility, 110,000 square feet, our utility costs are half of what they are in our old facility at 70,000 square feet. That's going to pay dividends for a long time because it's reduced the costs. But it has more dividends in how it's perceived by the people we do business with. It also sends a great message to our own employees. It isn't a matter of how much more is it going to cost. It's a matter of what's the best building I can get for the money that I have. It's a subtle difference, but it's an important one. We are right in the mid-range of what a Class A structure in St. Louis would cost.